Hello viewers, welcome to my channel KK Concepts of Electrical Engineering. Expression for magnetic field intensity due to infinitely long coaxial cable. Consider a coaxial cable. This is outer conductor is having minus I current. Inner conductor is carrying current I and the radius is A and this one is B and this one is C. Inner conductor carrying current I and the radius is small a and the outer conductor carrying current minus I C minus B radius let or is less than a which is nothing but inside the inner conductor we have seen the formula h equals to i by 2 pi r r square divided by capital r square in our case h is given by i by 2 pi r smaller is r square capital r is a square r r square gets cancelled magnetic field intensity is given by a square of r amperes per meter inside the inner conductor from which we can say h is proportional to r let r equals to a h equals to i a divided by 2 pi a square from the above formula we are going to get i by 2 pi a amperes per meter let r is greater than a less than b which is nothing but in between inner and outer conductors Outside the current carrying conductor, which is given by I by 2 pi R. In this case, H is proportional to 1 by R. Now let R equals to B. H equals to I by 2 pi R, which is nothing but B. Let R is greater than B and less than C inside the outer conductor. From Ampere's law, closed integral H dot dl equals to the total current enclosed. Total current is given by I plus current enclosed between C and B. Now, considering inside outer loop, that is, this one is C and this one is B. Let us let us take radius R. Current density J equals to the current is minus I flowing inside the outer conductor divided by pi into R square minus B square. Since minus I is the current area in between the radius R and radius B is given by pi R square minus pi B square from which we can write i divided by pi is common r square minus b square which equals to minus i is the current flowing pi c square minus b square is the area of the outer conductor from which i is given by minus i of r square minus b square 
divided by c square minus b square pi pi gets cancelled. Closed integral of h dot dl is given by minus i minus i of r square minus b square divided by c square minus b square. Closed integral of h dot dl is equals to taking i common c square minus b square minus r square plus b square divided by c square minus b square b square b square gets cancelled then in this case closed integral of dl is given by i into c square minus r square divided by c square minus b square in which h is constant so plus dl is given by i c square minus r square divided by c square minus b square where dl is equals to 2 pi r then h is given by i by 2 pi r of c square minus r square divided by c square minus b square. Let r is greater than c, which is nothing but outside the coaxial cable. Outside the coaxial cable is equal to 0. Then h equals to 0. Since the total current enclosed outside the cable is given by inner cable is positive i and outer cable is negative i which equals to 0. So current outside the coaxial cable is 0. So magnetic field intensity h equals to 0. Let us try to plot the relation between h and r. This is my coaxial cable carrying a current minus i outer cable and this is inner cable carrying a current i. The radius of inner cable is a. The radius from here to here is c and this is b. From the center, we will try to plot R. When R is less than A, which is nothing but inside the cable and at 0, the formula here is I by 2 pi R. So when R is 0, the total value is 0. From here to A, so point A, 0, the relation is H is proportional to R, or else as R increases h increases so at this point r equals to a h equals to i by 2 pi a before this h equals to i by 2 pi small r from here to b between a and b h is inversely proportional to r which is nothing but reduces as the r increases. The value is h equals to i by 2 pi r. In between c and b, h equals to i by 2 pi r c square minus r square c square minus b square. h is mostly proportional to r, so reduces. Outside the coaxial cable, h 0. Here, h equals to 0 outside and this one is h equals to i by 2 pi r c square minus r square divided by c square minus b square. If you have any suggestions and queries, please mention in the comments. If you like this video, please like, share and subscribe. Thank you for watching the video. Please stay tuned for more videos.